resin drops. Just trying to use up some of this leftover resin here. And I think we'll add it to the little unicorn and bunny mold that we have here. Of course, we gotta make sure that get all the resin in there good. So we don't get any air bubbles. And then you gotta make sure I get it in that little horn there. Because sometimes that unicorn horn tends to not get the resin inside of it. it. Ends up with a little bubble. So again, I'm gonna use my little back massager here to try to get out any of the bubbles. It will vibrate them to the surface. I tell you, if I could get my hands on um, one of those dental shaker tables that they use um, to make um, molds of the teeth so that they can turn around and, and you know, make your dentures or whatever is needed, right? Um, I was a dental assistant for a while. And uh, so that type of a shaker kind of a vibration table I think would be perfect for us resin artists, but they're a little pricey. <laughs> so next best thing.